Hello and Goodbye, a Spiritual Exercise of Discernment. Mary and Martha went through the experience of their brother Lazarus becoming ill and then dying. It was traumatic and difficult. As they were beginning to adjust to the new normal of the loss of their brother, Jesus, who had been mysteriously absent, suddenly arrives in the midst of their mourning. The reaction is, naturally, if you had been here. During a time of pandemic, it is just as natural for us to ask the same question, to wonder, where is God in all this? We are invited to turn back to that same story of Mary, Martha, and Lazarus. Let your attention be drawn to Mary. At the beginning of the story, the narrator mentions that she had been the one who anointed Jesus' feet and wiped them with her hair. What is amazing about this is that in the overall narrative, this has not happened yet. It happens later, and yet the narrator tells us about it now. I think this calls us to a moment of reflection about how life changed for that family. To be sure, after the illness had passed and after they had been reunited beyond death, their lives returned to a kind of normal. Yet as the second half of the story tells us, their lives were fundamentally changed in profound and good ways, the kinds of ways that led Mary to find costly, expensive perfume and to praise and worship Jesus with it. They had a brand new normal. Their experience in Jesus' mysterious absence and presence caused them to review their lives. They found things to say hello to and things to say goodbye to. Take a moment and think about what your experience of stay at home and the mysterious absence and presence of Jesus are calling you to say hello to and goodbye to. What have you learned in this difficult time that has been life-giving in spite of that difficulty? What have you discovered that you love that has been missing? What costly perfume do you want to take with you to the other half of this story? What has been holding you back from abundant life? What is cluttering your life that keeps you from joy and a truly good life? Resources for your reflection are available on the church's website. The link can be found in the video description. You may either print the image there out or you may use it as a guide to create your own drawing. Use either your drawing or the printed image. You may color it in, take notes on it, use it however you wish to reflect on the things to which you feel called to say hello to and goodbye to to help you discern what new life God is calling you into. After you have finished, prayerfully rest in the presence of the loving God with your thoughts and then plan with God on how to move through the remainder of our time in a healthy, life-changing and life-giving way that will bring such joy and celebration to the second half of our story. Grace and peace be with you. Amen.